well, 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 Devs Gambit is the game that I'm training right now, and I'm not gonna lie, I'm gonna mad because the world don't want me to play this game on my channel, apparently. Uh, let me show you uh, one thing. See here, there's a character uh, level one. And the reason behind this is because I actually try to record this game one moment and I thought it was everything okay. I had already recorded like one plus hours of uh, content, but my audio was a complete mess because I'm dumb basically. I thought I could have. Uh, uh, reduce the background noise without damaging too much the audio and I was wrong so I had to throw everything away and start again but when I decided to start again from zero it felt like uh, the world outside my door was exploding I mean everything was making a lot of noise and I don't even know that right now is the moment for me to actually record things properly I, I, I wish I wish it is and that's why it's level one right because I had the first playthrough with a lot of uh, noise then I restarted and there were uh, again a lot of noise so yeah I kind of mad, but this game is really good and I really want to play it. So let's start for the first time. So this is the character creation, and basically we choose a class and an item. And you can see here the different types of classes. Each one has different stats, and each stat influences on something. Uh, vitality, you know, health points, uh, strength, uh, damage with certain types of weapons, and finesse. It's finesse? I think it is, yes. Uh, also influence on certain types of weapons, interesting stamina, intelligence and magic. And haste, uh, what is haste? Uh, oh, stamina regeneration rate and ability cooldown rate, okay. So, uh, every class starts with basically this item, this other item, and two, uh, and a weapon slot and a shield. And there's the noble class, which begins with more items but I think it's much more of a uh, balanced class but I think uh, it only comes with more items because it's a novel and it has something to do with the story of the game I won't be taking too much of time uh, thinking about uh, which class I want to take because I already did that and I still don't really regret my decision because I like mages and I'm gonna just uh, do the same thing uh, I chose this item because it favored uh, my class and let's go Playing dead were you? Shame it's always the cowards that survive Concealed in the fate of your men, I thought I'd do them a service. Go back to Varos. You have an obligation to their families now. Well, uh, there's this guy here that is telling me that I have something to do with all those soldier families. I don't recall being something like a general or something, but I know that I can deal damage to this guy. But as far as I remember, he's uh, 
he's helping me at, at some extent so I don't know if killing him right now uh, is even an option but I don't want to find out Back so soon. Uh, you probably didn't expect death to appear and to look this cool and my first playthrough I got freaked out because it came out of nowhere was 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 a good reaction better get used to it this contract will resurrect you in service to me rest assured your mind and actions will be your own though why you mortals insist in glorifying a self-aggrandizing hoax is beyond me in return you must do something for me. Give it time. For now, just sign here. In blood, of course. So we got uh, Death's contract, which uh, says that I need to work for Death. And I can break this, uh, this contract wherever I want to but it says here that I want to uh, be mortal again so I can only like respawn because of this contract right I think it is and I know that I have to do this and on my first playthrough I completely forgot about this I thought it was already equipped so let's take my horse and let's go I had theories about the oh those uh those things falling from the sky and now I notice that uh it's related to where my mouse goes. No, I think I, I'm going crazy. I don't know. Uh I was trying to guess what that thing meant on my first playthrough and I still don't know. Oh, there's an item here that I always do the same mistake. Uh, what is this? Uh, restore all health. Okay, sorrow health. Uh, do I have to equip this? Uh, I don't think so. No, no, no. I think I just have to use it. Crow plume. Okay. I don't remember the items, it's been a long time since I last played this game, to be honest. And my second attempt to record this only lasted like a few minutes uh, because it was really early. Like when my horse arrived uh, down here, uh, it was a moment that I was like, yeah, I, I am gonna able to be recording anymore. Hopefully everything goes fine this time. So I know that this is something important. It's like the it's like Dark Souls, the bonfires. And I have to activate this. Oh, and that purple thing uh, flying around me is uh, is this. And and I think that uh, it gives me intellect uh, abilities can increase. Okay, so it will only be really worthy uh, of using it when I have uh, abilities, which will take some time. So here's the first enemy. I can't even act surprise anymore, but I'm think. But I think I'm still bad at this game. Like, I'm really bad at this game. Because of the stamina. And because... Look at this. I can't... Uh, shoot without facing the, the direction. Uh, I'm aiming. So... It's really hard. You have a death wish. Eluding death give you a god complex. 
next I see. If you intend to squander your life, go right on ahead. I'm sure your men are eager to see you. But should you think twice, take one of these. They're restorative plumes. Use it to ensure your return to Vados. Consider it the last kindness I offer you. Compared to what lies ahead, I assure you it is. So, uh... There's a kind guy, Vreo. Vreo? Is that how I pronounce her name? Um, uh, He burned me alive. I don't really remember this. But if my character is saying, I'm gonna believe it. Well, I should level up a little bit of my health. Let's do this. So, it's a Souls-like game. Uh, the level up system works basically the same way. This sacrifice to reclaim sacrifice. Okay, uh, the souls of this game are shards, and there are the plumes, which are. I mean, there's different types of plumes. Oh, there's the lucent plume, which heals me. Like in Dark Souls, there's that item that heals you, and I can actually spend. Those flowers, those plumes actually, to increase my damage. That's really cool concept. And I can recover some that I lose uh, through here. Not so sure how am I gonna lose, like if I die and can't recover my stuff. As I said, I never died on my first playthrough, so yeah. Uh, what it says, uh, resting regenerates used feathers, uh, use Q to the Q, oh, okay, skill to heal. Oh, no, 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 uh, let's take out, no, no, I, I'm messing up. All right, now, uh, you teach me to use shields no to kick right I do this and no not this it's another oh no 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 what it's not it's, it's what is the key oh it's attack right no <gasps> I made a I made a berry uh, I made it very uh, unintentionally. Secondary weapon button. Oh, okay, okay. Completely. Can I walk with my shield? Okay. No, no, no. Dude, the, the attacks of each enemy is like... They, they do really long dashes. Forward. So, yeah. Oh no, I was more careful when I was first playing, <clears throat> what happened to my voice? I was way more careful when I was playing this game for the first time. <laughs> oh, and I know the some secrets, like this one. So I got the cape, which gives me, which gives me more vitality. Uh, I got boots. I don't remember actually getting boots on my first playthrough, but yeah. Uh, this one has F toughness. No, it's no. This one has F toughness and C tough. I think I think C is better than F, but this one makes me move like faster. But uh, I'll keep I'll keep mine. Oh no, 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 no. I remember that it was really hard to hit those guys because the place that I am aiming doesn't necessarily mean I'm gonna, I'm gonna hit it. I have to be on a specific angle and I got a dragon berry, which was one of the novels 
uh, items. So, yeah, that was good. And now there's an enemy here. I remember everything. Can I? Oh, I thought I, I could have kicked him. Fragile courage. Oh, increases vitality. Oh, by 15? That's a lot. Uh, the strength. Uh, we're finding the dire. Okay. <laughs> I don't, don't actually want to spend that much time reading. But I'm using this just because I only gain intellect or intelligence. I think they mean the same thing. If I cast uh, abilities. And I'm not really near the moment where I can use a, uh, abilities. So why bother now? I'm gonna up my intelligence by 10. So I can do more damage, and I think it's important. I don't know if I'm doing the right thing, but I'm doing something. Oh, wait a minute. Uh, why am I with two, like, uh, things following me? Wasn't supposed to be only the green one, which was the... The last aura that I equipped. Oh, I can I can spell. My first playthrough was like really long because I think I was really scared about everything that this game showed me. Oh no. I know that I can do things like oh I missed. No, 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 no. I have to do this to the spell and throw. Okay. Now he has no shield and I can manage to attack him. And yes. Come on, dude. Oh, I dodged it. No. That was close. That was really close. And there's another really interesting aspect of this game, which is the which is the the spells. Uh, each spell uh, combined with another uh, works in a different way. You you see you saw that if I do this and I do this again at any moment. Oh, messed up. Wait, no, I'm really scared to take any single hit. All right, maybe I exaggerated. All right, all right, everything's fine, everything's fine, everything's not fine. Everything's totally fine. Everything's not fine. No, how oh, I missed it. No, 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 no. Die. Yeah. I got a whole word. Well, I won't be using anyway. And of course, all the enemies respawn because, yeah. Oh, crowd bloom. Oh, I remember this guy. He just falls. Crystal bomb. No. If I do this, I kill him instantly? Yeah, this. Let me just. Yeah, I remember you. Oh, thanks for the shards. Appreciate it. Oh no 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 no! Oh 
can't believe this. <sighs> Am I moral? I suppose it was too much for me to expect you to read the fine print. You exist in a state of limbo. Neither truly dead nor truly alive. Death, as you mortals know it, is merely one facet of its infinite complexities. Make no mistake, you are in an unnatural state of flux, and it will take its toll on you. I can't, I can't believe, I can't believe I honestly died. But, I mean, everything, every item is with me. I didn't lost my souls. Uh, is that it? I mean, uh, is it related to this bloom or this bloom? I have three? No, I have two. I have two. Wait. No. Uh, um. Uh, only she? No. It says that it heals me, Ollie. And this one. Uh, restores you to the last death idol. And this is a death idol. I think I don't know. I don't. I don't understand. I was supposed to be dead, right? Reclaim abilities. I have all these abilities. I think uh, it comes for our different classes. I wonder if I'll be able to get different skills. I mean, I wonder if I will be able to get uh, skills from different classes. So, there's a thing that I need to level up, which is my endurance. Because I need stamina to attack, so I'm just gonna level up that 